What's up guys welcome back to yet another video. So after almost 2 months we have been receiving a new update for OnePlus 7 series which is Oxygen OS 11.0.6.1. So in this video let's quickly take a look at this latest update from OnePlus for OnePlus 7 series. So without wasting any more time let's get started. So here I have my OnePlus 7 Pro on which I have already received the OTA update of Oxygen OS 11.0.6.1. Here you can take a look at the software information. Android version is Android 11. We get 1st Feb 2022 security patch now. And the build number says Oxygen OS 11.0.6.1. And it's a stage rollout. If you guys haven't received the OTA update, you can just download the file given in the description below. All the download links or the latest firmware have been updated in the description. Download the file and place it inside the internal storage. Later you just have to go to settings, system, system update and tap on this gear icon towards the right top corner select local upgrade and you should have the file here in the local upgrade section selecting it will upgrade your device to the latest build and guys i think this is the last stable android 11 update for oneplus 7 series next update what we're gonna see would be oxygen os 12 open beta 1 and hopefully that is expected in the month of march end or april initial days so stay tuned for that if you get any information about oxygen os 12 for oneplus 7 series we'll update you guys about the same and now before moving ahead guys let's keep a like target of 400 likes on this video still we have 80 percent of users who haven't subscribed to our channel so it's a humble request do consider subscribing and also press the bell icon to get notified whenever we upload a new video now talking about the benchmark results here with the geekbench application single core have scored 701 and multi-core have scored 2430 on the previous update single core had scored 720 and with multi-core we got scores which were 2330 so slightly higher benchmark results in the multi-core segment with anto2 benchmark application on this latest build we got scores of 5,42,899 but on the previous build scores were 5,43,823 we also did cpu throttling test wherein device cpu max throttled up to 82 percent but we got to see some dips in the graph while doing cpu throttling on this build, camera app version remains same and this camera app version haven't changed since Oxygen OS 11.0.4.1. After that, there's no update with the launcher also. And guys, let me know in the comment section below whether you guys have got the security level of L1 after this update or not. Because there are still users who are facing issues with the Widevine security level. With the past update, some users got the Widevine security level to L3. And also you guys let me know in the comment section below whether you want a complete detailed review on this build or not. Because I used this latest build for some time and I personally did not notice any kind of major issues. Now talking about the change logs of this latest build. So let's go to system update section and here you can see we have the small list of changes done with this latest build in which they have updated the security patch to Feb 2022 and later improved system stability and the update size was around 166 MB on my OnePlus 7 Pro. We still don't get the support of 90 FPS on this build also. Still if you set the graphics settings to smooth and 90 FPS, the max output given by OnePlus 7 Pro is 60 FPS. Don't know when OnePlus gonna fix this issue. Most users purchase OnePlus devices for gaming part and the plus point was OnePlus used to deliver 90 FPS in games like PUBG which is now Battlegrounds Mobile India. Though if you do gaming on OnePlus smartphones with 60 FPS there are no issues to be seen. I prefer gaming using 60 FPS instead of 90 FPS. And this 90 FPS is not only limited to OnePlus 7 series, it's the same case with OnePlus 8 and OnePlus 9 series. On devices like OnePlus 9 which is running Oxygen OS 12, still they have max output of 60 FPS. Though if you guys want 90 FPS on OnePlus smartphones which are running Oxygen OS 11, then we have made a dedicated video. I'll leave that video guide in the description below and that thing is not working on Oxygen OS 12 but if you are a user of OnePlus 7 series and OnePlus 8 series which haven't got the official support of Oxygen OS 12 then you guys can try out that method to enable 90 FPS. So guys there's nothing much to show in this video because we don't have any kind of major changes done over the previous update. But still if you guys want a complete review then do let me know in the comment section below. As of now only this much in this video. I hope you guys like the video. If you like the video then do give me a thumbs up. And also if you are new to our channel then do not forget to subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.